in all these three divisions thallophyta bryophyta and pteridophyta the reproductive organs are inconspicuous what does that mean they are not so easily visible so such plants are called they are put in one group together as cryptogamy crypto means hidden and gamy means marriage the example of pteridophyte is fern horsetail marsilia now why suddenly i have come to cryptogamy because the other groups that we are going to study they have very well developed and conspicuous reproductive organs and that is called phanerogamy in phanerogamy there is seed formation but what kind of seed is formed normally seed that we eat is well inside a fruit so it is a covered seed but in some plants like pines and deodars the seeds are naked so they are grouped separately in both gymnosperms as well as angiosperms what we find is that seed formation is there so they have been separated from the cryptogamy but whether seeds are naked or not that is the next criteria so phanerogamy can be gymnosperms or angiosperms in the case of gymnosperms there are tall trees very well developed root stem and leaf naked seeds now these trees are very good in giving wood so they are perennial which means evergreen and woody example are pine deodar this even christmas tree is a gymnosperm 